Okay, so we got him. Wasn't bad. Statue up here, nope. Let's just walk real slow. And see what's about. I wonder what's inside. Shadow to the tome. You can always use the harp's mud juice. down there. This is up here. So there was that little section that we hadn't explored yet. Good thing we went and checked it out. We've obviously been all over here. All these chests are open. That's a cool relief right there. So well designed. Okay, let's carry on through here. This looks interesting. Large nut. Have we sufficient stores of oil? Yeah, we do. Let's consult our map here and see. We've been all over. When jumping down a ledge, judge well the distance. Let's close my eyes and go for it. For being honest. It's so nice not being able, being able to not get wet with that ring. Oh, the light cure is really nice. Any magical debilitation that'll cure. Hmm. Hello, Batsies. Ah, those damn things. Oh, I can get wet. My lantern doesn't go out yet. That's so cool. Take care, you want soaked in water. I won't be. Oh shoot, those maggots. That's interesting. Sure looks like you can go that way right there. You knock that magic shield off and turn off that bat. Oh god, you guys are though. We have triumphed. The fiends are swift. Be wary. Those things. What's up, buddy? Ah. Oh. The tail is severed. Last he just got to knock his tail off. Is this the big guy? Nah, they're the same size. Oh, shoot. There he is. Shit. Let's get this guy. Hey, I like 
light him on fire, and that'll distract him a little bit here. Come on, guys, let's get him. Oh, where'd he go? There he is, he's still there. Laying on him, there we go. Crystal, so there's 2,000. Giant rank fish. Rift cluster. Okay. Watch out. Don't fall off. Soak to the bull. Okay, that was cool. We hadn't figured that out before. Watch your footing, Master. A fall can kill ready as any beast. Yeah. Fall damage is a real thing in this game. It is absolutely enormous. What? Oh, so this is the eyeball. So, I'm gonna try shooting a couple of pawns at it and see how much damage I can do. First, let's make sure that Poppy and everybody don't have anything that we're going to lose that they picked up on the way. No. Okay. What's up? I'm sorry. Taking your soul. Oh, what's up? Focus your attack! Oh, that worked really well. Look at it. Knocked away two lives. Get up, Poppy. Now, put out Hurry. Sorcerer's Quartz. I mean, we're not going to beat it, guys. You know? We're just gonna make as far a run in here as we can. We can always get Buat D back, and the other pawns we're not too concerned with. Muad'Dib that lost his life. Now, Poppy, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All you guys. Boom. Right in his eye. That way I can see if I can get... Oh, God. So I can get past him here somehow. Oh, hello. 
Sorcerer's Quartz. What even is that shit? <gasps> Macabre Sculpture. We want that. Yeah. Sorcerer's Quartz. And the doorway over here. Yeah, I don't, uh, don't know, guys. I think we're gonna have to transport out of here. I think, uh, this is the only way out, it looks like. And we've pretty much exhausted all of our resources, aka all of our pawn arrows. What is he doing? Understand any of that. So let's go run around here and we'll see what's going on. Something heavy. Sobering wine, we don't care about that. Oh god. Whoa. Whoa. We want crack warp. What's that? King Warish. Do not get caught right there. Yep, there's nothing else down here. We gotta go. So... Okay, so we definitely know that we gotta beat that eye to go any farther. And so we're pretty much done with the bitter black section for now, guys. Let's go and turn this stuff in. We'll get our pawns back. My hope is that I may I shall for now my I don't have any items, okay. For now my course pray. Cool. So I bet if we get the bigger version of sacrifice pawn, we might be able to kill that guy. But we're gonna continue with the main story for a while here. Then we'll get back to doing this. Knowing the Riftstone is close at hand. So let's get a couple more pawns here and replace them. Hello. Basically the same one. I like that poppy version of you. I am honored. A straight up fighter with a big old hammer and cool armor. I want one more sorcerer. Yes, Arisen. Hello. I am honored. This pawn feels most at ease near a rift. So let's see what we got. These are all, well, let's go slay the Gore Cyclops in Soul Flare Cannon. You know. We did this already, didn't we? Mind the edge, Master. That was close. Okay, let's fast travel back. Nice. It's a grand sword. We 
We're gonna drop some stuff off, resupply. And then we'll go to Soul Flare Cannon and fight this Gore Cyclops. What meaning do you suppose those stones hold? To support Crystal Master. To support Crystal Master. It's all nighttime. Nobody's out. You got any new weapons, buddy? Sorry. Me, I've no iron and the master works. Not really. The master works come again. We're gonna have to start selling stuff here soon. I hear no one. At your pick, what will it be today? Pulled three wake stones out of it, that's pretty good. What will it be today? Have your pick. Any you like. What will it be today? Let's see about learning a skill here. Everything's all maxed out as far as vocation level goes. Thank you for your sacrifice. Whoops. What will it be today? I saw a new skill there under special augments. Do you guys see that? Secret augments. Recuperation. Hastens the speed with which you recover lost health from curative magic and health springs. What will it be today? Have your pick. Any you like. Come again soon. Well, let's rest here, I guess. Just a... Have your pick. What will it be today? Understood. I'm gonna have to start getting rid of items here pretty soon. Just because we've got too much stuff. I'm too heavy. And even putting all that stuff in storage, still too heavy. I, the inn offers a clean bed, but it deals in My help my Yeah, I'm still average. Besides. This inn can serve as the hub of our journeys. Why not stay? Take all the time you like. I know I'm more than two of anything. Panchia, I will have two or four of those because they're really good. I don't even know what half this stuff is for. I don't even use half this stuff. Wait, I want the King Wash. Take all the time you love. Let's get our mushrooms. We need about 40 of them, or 50. Take all the time you do come again. Thank you. Let's see if we can enhance anything with all of our new If you've caused the craft, especially if the master works all. The master works all, you can't come again. Okay, so we're gonna go. Can you hear me, Arisen? Even without a heart, our blood can still boil. Our undying bodies rolling like a storm. Clouds. We are butchers, you and I. Whatever pretense we might carry, we'll never wash away the stench of blood and death from our hands. So let us not deny our true nature, but embrace it in a test of will. Okay? 
The Gore Cyclops and Soul Flare Canyon. It's all the way over here. So let's head out. All these workers going about their business. The life of a salesman oh, surely has its own trials. Your different countries, cities, people. So we've beaten a ton of monsters here, but we still haven't found the Hydra either. We'll get Gore Cyclops and see what this immortal helm is. That sounds like a really, really sick item. The mild weather year round makes Gramsus well suited for human life. Now, like I always say, there's no fast travel in this game aside from port crystals and traveling back to the main town, which in and of itself is really nice. You're lucky that we even have that. With Gram Soren as a base, we ought to be able to travel even more. They could have given us nothing, and you know, we could have had to run everywhere all the time for everything. It seems like we do anyways, but it's been a while since we've really had to. We've placed our port crystals very well, several locations, so as not to have to do this all the time. So I don't mind every once in a while having to run. It causes for good exploration. No, they hold the advantage. Soak to the boom. Come on, let's just keep rolling, guys. There's nothing here for really challenge us. We've beaten those guys a ton of times. We gotta get more deep, some better stuff, though. He dies fast. Because all he's got are those uh, robes. I think he needs more armor. More actual defense. Yep, we got a long ways to go, guys. But I gotta make sure I'm going the right way here because there's one. Yeah, we gotta cross this bridge here. And we can go this way. That's fine. If we follow the road, we'll be okay. Stick to the beaten path. Don't worry about the wolves. Ignore all that stuff. If victory is elusive, seek new allies. Where that fails, seek new foes. Soul Flare Canyon seems to be some place they like us to return to a lot. We've had several quests that run us through Soul Flare Canyon. Maybe because it's one of these sections that's part of the end game. Because it's right by the last section of the game. In fact, you have to go through there to get to the last section of the game, the Great Wall section. Oh, good to know. An abbey lies at the heart of these withered woods. Wonder what's in the abbey and where it is. It's right over here. I bet you it's right here. Let's check it out real quick. I'm interested now that he said something about it. You can see an old path right here. Moldy pumpkin. Every beast has its weakness. Observe closely and learn to exploit it. I bet you the Abbey's right through here. Watch out for that. We may be able to glean material from the boulders of this world. There it is. There's an Abbey right there. These woods are kind of crazy. Dangerous to walk the cliff's edge. Every beast has its weakness. Observe closely and learn to exploit it. Hmm. 
Hmm. See who's in the abbey. Hello, crow. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I think what they should do in Dragon's Dogma 2 is get rid of the poor crystals and just use the rifts as transportals. You can go in there and get your pawns, then you're in the rift and you can travel using the rift. I think that'd be a great way to do it. it looks like a cottage. This doesn't give you fast travel everywhere, but it gives you more access. With less shit in your inventory. But it is nice to be able to just put that down wherever you want, really. And fast travel back to that select location. Let's see what the nun says. Do you get men? The one they call Dragonsbane once took up the mantle of Arisen himself. Huh. So Duke Edmund was a dragon. Was a <clears throat> Abby here. Dragonborn the arisen. For such pursuits. Is that Mason? Ah, happy coincidence to find you here, Arisen. Huh. Yeah, no well, kidding. Let's pray. That's weird you're here. Since ancient times, the doors of the faith have been open to Arisen as they go about their work. I know not if we can aid your quest, but we shall try with all our strength. Okay. Well. <laughs> Just move into a secret tunnel or something, or is there a place we can rest here or something? As you like know by now, my aim is to learn the designs of a certain. I've about enough information gathered to pick up and head home. Another strange coincidence, friend. Seems a lady friend of yours is eager to become acquainted with the organization I serve. Wow. We share a certain bond by now, you and I. I'm not beyond giving the girl an introduction, should the opportunity. Like as not, she'll need it. There huh. are as many youths who wish to train at the cathedral as there are grains of sand in your little village. That girl newly come to the abbey certainly holds you in her trust. Eh, friend? <laughs> Trust's a tricky teen. Not for the craven, that much is sure. It's crazy how much dialogue he has on this one subject. That girl newly... I mean, that was like seven or eight lines of dialogue written just for that specific section. So there's something, somebody we know, an NPC, might be that blonde Madeline girl, is trying to join his clan or crew or whatever, so we'll have to go figure that out later. It's obviously important if you said it that many times. Ron's gauntlets, we've had those before. Okay, let's continue on to Soul Flare Canyon. 